Hello, this is a Kinga review, and we're going to be doing this question. Solve by using the zero product property. Well, when you look at this equation, we don't have a zero, do we? So what can we do? Well, we can make a zero. So what I mean by that is when we do x plus 1 times n squared is equal to x plus 1, we can subtract both sides by the x plus 1, can't we? So this right side will turn into a 0. And so this equation now says x plus 1 times n squared minus x plus 1 is equal to 0. So there's your 0. But this left side is now a little bit ugly. So let's factor the x plus 1 from this and that to make it a little bit nicer. So if we do that, we're going to get x plus 1 times n squared minus 1. And that's going to equal 0. So now we have our familiar uh, structure of the equation. And we just have to set this part equal to 0 and that part equal to 0. So it's going to say x plus 1 is equal to 0 and n squared minus 1 is equal to 0. Well, if we subtract 1 from both sides for this equation, you're going to get x is equal to negative 1. And as for this equation, we're going to add 1 to both sides. That's going to give us n squared is equal to 1. Take the square root of both sides. You're going to get n is equal to plus or minus 1. So this and that would be your answer. But you realize something, that the question says x is not going to equal negative 1. So we have to say this is going to be wrong. And so our only answer is going to be when n is equal to plus or minus 1. And that's why option D is your correct answer. Now let's look at each of the other options. Well, option A only has n equals 1, and we know that when we have to take the square root of both sides, we have to add on that plus or minus 1, because negative 1 squared is still 1. So that's why this is wrong. Option B says n is equal to negative 1, so it's already missing that plus 1. So this is wrong. And option C says n equals 1, so it's missing a negative 1. That's why that's wrong. And also, for b and c, it says x equals 1, but we know that x has to equal negative 1 from this equation here. So these are wrong, too. That's why the answer to this question is D 